Welcome to the first race of the Mountain Dew Cup Series. We have 32 drivers lined up to see who takes the win in the first ever race. We have a fun one for you today, so let's get to the track. They start off by going down the steep orange ramp, and then they get to the track and they approach the intersection where we see a ton of crashes. They then continue where they approach a 90 degree bank turn where they will approach the finish line. There will be four cars in each group, so let's get right to it. In the first race, it's Ryan Blaney, Martin Truex Jr., Ross Chastain, and Noah Gregson. It's going to be Sponge in the 62 car. Blaney with the lead, and they go through the corner, and it looks like Ryan Blaney is going to get the win in the first race. Truex keeps second from Chastain. Now in the second race, it's Ryan Blaney with an even larger lead. And it looks like Blaney will easily win with Chastain getting second over Martin Truex Jr. And Ryan Blaney will advance. Now in the second group, it's Corey LaJoy, Brad Kozlowski, Michael McDowell, and Joy Logano. It's going to be Kozlowski with the lead. And he gets turned in front of the pack. And he's just going to block the whole field. And Kozlowski will win. And Corey LaJoy goes off track. But it looks like he barely made it to the line. So now it's Kozlowski with the lead. Oh, and McDowell goes hard in the wall. Kozlowski will cruise on to get the win, but Michael McDowell will not finish and not receive any points in DNF. Let's take a look at this hard crash. Oh, and it looks like Joey Logano just sent him in the wall. Very unlucky for McDowell there. Not very surprising since it's from Joey Logano. Now in the third race, it's Eric Jones, Austin Sendrick, Kyle Busch, and Chase Briscoe. And it's Matthew Rowdy in the 18 car. Cindric with a slight lead over Jones. And looks like Jones is going to take that position with that preferred line. And Eric Jones will win the first race. Cindric barely beat Kyle Busch to the line to get second. Now in the second race, it's Eric Jones with the lead again. And coming out of the corner, Eric Jones will win again in advance. This time, Kyle Busch gets the position over Cindric. In the fourth race, it's Justin Haley, Christopher Bell, Daniel Suarez, and Ricky Stanis Jr. It's Jose Miguel Morano in the 31 car. I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong. It's going to be Justin Haley with the lead, and he's going to block Christopher Bell, and Justin Haley will get the win as the 99 of Daniel Suarez goes off track, and he will DNF. Now in the second race, it's Justin Haley with a huge lead. Christopher Bell very far behind. And Justin Haley is going to win the second race. Next up, it's Alex Bowman, Austin Dillon, William Barn, and Kevin Harvick. In the 48 car, it's Enrique Argarello. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. Bowman with the lead. And coming out of the corner, Alex Bowman will win the first race. This time in the second race, it's very even between Austin Dillon and Alex Bowman. But Alex Bowen with the preferred line will win the second race. And William Byron gets second over Austin Dillon. Next up, it's Todd Gillen, Bubba Wallace, Trace Elliott, and Kurt Busch. It's NASCAR Kid 9719 in the 9 car. Very even between Bubba Wallace and Todd Gillen. And it's going to be very close going to the line. It's a photo finish, actually. But Todd Gillen barely gets the position over Bubba Wallace. In the second race, Todd Gillen with the lead, and Todd Gillen in the preferred line will win and advance. Bo Wallace second, and Chase Elliott third. In the seventh group, it's Kyle Larson, Harrison Burton, Tyler Reddick, and Denny Hamlin. It's Jackie Chan in the five car, and no context needed in the eleven car. Burton is going to edge out to the lead, and he's going to turn in front of Kyle Larson, and at the line, it's going to be Harrison Burton getting the win in the first race. Now, this time, Larson and Burton are side by side. And cruising on that top lane, it's going to be Kyle Larson winning the second race. So we're going to have a race off between Kyle Larson and Harrison Burton. And it looks like Kyle Larson will get the easy win over Harrison Burton. In the last race, it's Eric Amarola, Ty Dillon, Chris Buescher, and Cole Custer. It's going to be spazzed in the 42 car in this race. Amarola with the lead. 
Oh, and Chris Buescher goes into the wall, collects Cole Custer. Eric Amarola is going to win. And it looks like Chris Buescher will not make it to the line and DNF. This time in the second race, it's Amarola with the lead. And he's going to cut off Ty Dillon. And here comes Cole Custer. And at the line, it's Eric Amarola barely over Cole Custer. We will now take the winners from each group and put them in one big race. We will have three races, and whoever is leading on the final lap of the last race will win. Here's the first race. Brakozowski with the lead. He's going to get turned, and we have a big crash in the back. Brakozowski is going to... Looks like he's going to cruise on to the win, and we have a ton of DNFs. Ryan Blaney, Alex Bowman, Eric Amarola, and Kyle Larson all DNF. Let's take a replay of this big crash. It looks like Alex Bowman hit the wall first, and then behind them, Kyle Larson deflected off the wall into Eric Amarola. And then it looks like coming to the line, it looks like Brad Zosky and Justin Haley shoved Ryan Blaney off track that caused him to DNF. Very unlucky for Ryan Blaney right there. Now, with two laps to go, Kozlowski with the lead. Justin Haley trying to get it from him, but it's not going to happen. Brad Kozlowski wins race two. And Eric Jones is going to DNF. So now, with one more lap, can Brad Kozlowski hold off the pack? And he's going to get into the wall, but he puts it in reverse, and he's going to reverse it all the way through the corner. And coming over the line is Brad Kozlowski that's going to win the first ever race. Have you ever? No, I've never. Brad Kozlowski wins the first ever race in reverse. We gotta see how he did it. So he hits the wall, and he blocks both Justin Haley and Todd Gillen, and just reverses it all the way across the corner to win the race. That's something you see in Talladega Nights, not the Mountain Dew Cup Series. Congrats to Brad Kozlowski on the first ever race. Here are the creator points for this race. Thank you for watching today's event. There's some information about the next event at the end of this video. So if you want to sign up, make sure you pay attention to the times. We hope to see you next week for the second race.